Hello, I'm Will and today I'm hopefully going to be fixing a quite a bad issue with this second generation Moto G. Uh, the issue we have is that the home button doesn't function. So say for example we're in Chrome, the home button just doesn't work at all. Uh, the, and multitask doesn't work, e what doesn't work either. Uh, the only way to get out of applications is with the back button. And the other pretty significant issue is that you can't pull down the not notification tray. Um, so the first thing you're going to want to do is download Nova Launcher. Now this phone is also plagued with an issue with the Play Store so we're going to have to download it as an APK. Um, which should be fairly straightforward. If you have an Android smartphone then hopefully you're familiar with this. Uh, find the latest version the one with the highest number and uh, released most recently. Uh, try and avoid all the adverts. Uh, this is the download button you want. Okay, J let's just give that a minute. Okay. So now you're going to want to open this APK file. You may need to go into the settings and enable installation of third-party applications. If you haven't already, it's, uh, the phone should guide you through the process. Okay, now it's installed, let's just go straight to open uh, and we can skip all this. Um, right, uh, we, we seem to have landed ourselves in the stock launcher. So let's jump into Nova Launcher. Right, we're now in Nova Launcher. What you need to do is press and hold on the home screen, uh, tap widgets, and drag and drop a new activity onto the home screen. Okay, bear with me. Uh, scroll down, and the one you're looking for is called, I'll know it when I see it, bear with, Setup Wizard. Uh, now the one you want to look for, let me just, um, the one you're looking for is called dot setup wizard test activity. Um, let's just tap that. Okay. And so you should now have, oh, we're on the wrong launcher. <laughs> it, it didn't create the activity. Um, Let's give that one more shot, okay? Um, okay. Settings, home. Make sure Nova Launcher is selected as the default home. Now what we're going to do is reboot it. Great, let's give this one last shot. Right, this is what should happen. So now you tap it and you'll be brought into this. Um, I should have mentioned this already. What you need to do is take the Mac off the phone and simply pop the SIM card out, put it aside. Now you should have no service and make sure that it doesn't know the Wi-Fi network. So in this case, it, it is not aware of, oh, don't want that to fall over. In this case, it's not aware of any of these networks. So now we click skip, skip anyway, accept and continue. This is correct. This is what's supposed to happen. Click OK. Now click the down arrow and again, next, and it should bring you back to
to the home screen, you can restore your previous launcher, which in this case is Google Now Launcher. And as you can see, we, we now have notifications. Um, and if we just go into Chrome, uh, the home button, the home button is working as you can see. We can back, go back to our original, original launcher. Yes, job done. Excellent. Uh, that was a bit of a, a bit of a long, long-winded, uh, long-winded video, and I apologise for that. But this phone is now working.